How's it going, sister mates? This is Monsieur Le Chance. Sorry, I like speaking French. I have some French wine over there that I'm going to drink later, and I'm looking forward to it. This is Mr. De Charles, and we're back with Final Fantasy II. Now, previously, we helped some people out of this mithril mine, but we, we still need to actually find some mithril for, for us, for, for some us time. Um, one thing, though, I don't know why, but Minwoo's got a yellow bar. Does that mean poison? I didn't notice that before. Okay, it's a, oh, maybe it means um, low on health, actually. Yeah, that makes more sense, okay. <laughs> maybe I should actually do something about that. Okay, fine, cool. So, obviously I can cure you, good. Use up some mana, but that's fine. Might as well heal the other boy. And then, yeah, I'll do fear as well. Whilst I'm at it, why not? Okay, but previously, we freed the people. Now we're going down this floor, and I'm pretty sure this is the last one before we get the Mithril. So, let's see what's here. Is it going to be easy, or is it going to be twisty-turny? It's going to be twisty-turny. Oh, what's this, though? No, it's just a casual bridge. Okay, that's fine. We'll be able to find some shit. A fire tome. Well, I've already learned fire like a million and one times, but okay, cool. All right, still seems casual as ever with all the goblins and stuff, so <laughs> hooray. We're up for another long haul of trying to kill things. Basically ruining the environment. Oh, oh, oh wait, there's infinite amount of species. Infinite amount of everything, if you think about it, you know. Just keep respawning again and again. Ever so fun. Can't wait for Final Fantasy XIII. Even though I know it's overcomplicated, it's got an overcomplicated story, you know, not even that many game mechanics, but at least things look kind of pretty and stuff. Alright, whatever. Got your game of strength in. Good, great. I, I, I work out when I walk in the spot. This is what I see. Maybe it's Club, actually. I haven't listened to that song in a while, okay? It's 2024 for you guys, although 2023 for me. Like, you know, I mean, that song must be released like 10 years ago by now. I must have a birthday or something coming up. Nah, I can find. But either way, you know, my boy works out. He just got to level up in strength. He's so strong. All right, fine. Anyway, oh god, there's more bridges. All right, let's go north. North's always good. What the hell is that? Should I be thinking about that door? Maybe. Maybe uh, it's where I need to go. No, it's just an empty. Pa yep, yeah, and now that oh great, I'm being attacked by birds. Why don't you guys like deliver babies or something? Isn't that what you guys normally do? Isn't that your purpose? To kind of like, you know, watch a woman getting born, snatch the baby, and then give it to like some other parents. I imagine that's what they do. I mean, yeah, I know it's an innocent way of thinking about how how, how babies are made, but uh, you know, I kind of like the idea of them being thieves. I think that's a bit more realistic as to how the baby ended up there. So better than what boss baby had anyway. Right, okay, so clearly one of these ways lead the way I need to go. I don't know which one it is. Oh, come on! <laughs> Why do I not have lightning? Just, just zap, zap, zap. Just strike them down. Ah, uh, fine. Again, I'm gonna try not to fast forward because that's a bad habit and it probably ruins it a bit for you guys. For all I know. Okay, fine, cool, great. Well, I still enjoy this game and I still wanna beat it. I wanna beat it, just beat it, beat it, mm. Man, I miss Michael Jackson. But that was one, thing, one of the fun things about the 2000s. I mean, I know he was more an 80s thing, as far as I know. 70s, 80s, because like 70s was kind of a disco guy. 80s, he had some of his best albums. But the thing is, when it was like 2000s, it was much more seeing him in like the media and culture and stuff. Like that one cameo in Method and in Black. And also the fact he wanted to be Spider-Man for some reason. And... That's about it. <laughs> I, I did other stuff though. You know, I kind of liked growing up with Michael Jackson. Kids don't have that, that stable connection. <laughs> I wouldn't really call that a stable connection, but yeah, you know, whatever. Oh, and as for the Peter Ball story, I, I, um, hmm. I think it happened. I think he did do it. Only because I saw the documentary Leaving Netherland, which is, um, well, I, I wouldn't say it's eye-opening necessarily. It gives you another side of the story. I think it was just about, like, two guys growing up that, um, you know, Happened to have been in uh, Michael Jackson's interests, a, a list of interested people. And then apparently stuff happened and they reward them with little like trinkets and stuff, which is nice. And like buy tons of shit for the families, always good. And then Michael Jackson would be like, hey, why don't, why don't I um, like take the kid away and then put him on a commercial? And, and logically the mum would be like, no, because I actually need to raise my son first. But you know. Fun predicament for you guys, though. Here's the thing. If you had someone that had done... Let's say Michael Jackson had done it. 
If he had done such horrifying things, would you stop listening to his music? This is the thing. This is the thing why I don't mind Michael Jackson's ex like existence. Assuming he did do that stuff. I can really tell I've had coffee today. <laughs> Just coming up with anything that comes out of my mind. Right, but if he really did that stuff, are you really going to damn him that much and say I don't enjoy his music anymore because he was such a terrible person? Here's the thing. In a hundred years time, that music is still going to be influential. That music is still going to be enjoyed by individuals. Whereas, as much as we shouldn't really be saying, hey, pedophiles, not really a, a, a good thing, you know, we shouldn't be in, like saying that their behavior is good because it's not. I, I get that. But like, if someone gives so much joy into the world and they did one or two bad things, you know, I'm just saying, there's probably like a philosophy lesson on that somewhere. I just, I'm on the side that if, if they've made that much of an impact, then, you know, how can you damn them? Uh, honestly, you know what? I was trying to say all that shit, just trying to escape this fucking bullshit. <laughs> I can't be arsed with all these goblins. I can't be asked so much I tried distracting myself with uh, the philosophy question of Michael Jackson. But uh, let me know what you guys think. I mean, again, I, I could get taken down for that comment. It's just, I don't know. I mean, uh, YouTube can be a place for thinking about this kind of stuff. It doesn't have to be just purely entertainment. Purely YouTube rewinds talking about, oh, we should, uh, you know, this is a great platform for people sharing food and celebrity stuff. And hey, we endorse the highly paid nice people. You know, we want to get involved with Google and stuff and then fucking... What am I even saying? This game's driving me crazy. <laughs> this game's driving me crazy. Round the bend, as they say in the UK. All right, Maria's dying. Just, a, just another day on Final Fantasy. Someone's dying of something. Yep, fine, good. Yep, take that. Not going to heal her, though, is it? Oh, I just hope I, I just wish I had like a, a map of the area. Yep, nice and healed. Cool, yep, using all my mana up because I don't need it. Alright, so it's not right and it's not down and it's not up, I don't think. We went down, there's nothing there. We went up, there's nothing there. So this is a dead end. There's nothing, nothing at all. D do I have to? Do, just, just first off, do I have to? Yeah, but do I have to? Oh, yeah, the big... Uh, whatever, fine. Say what you want about Final Fantasy 1, but at least in, in Final Fantasy 1, you know, you could clear the enemies quickly. Whether it would be lightning, running away, fuck it, whatever. Why do I have to tolerate this still? I, I'm not even struggling. I'm not even struggling anymore. The only one that's struggling is Maria. That's because she's useless. She needs to work out more. She needs to go to the gym. She needs to do a, a guy, become a big, strong male, grow a penis. Not exactly something I want for myself, but fuck it. Alright, maybe I didn't go this way, because this doesn't feel familiar all of a sudden. Right, yep. Yeah. Uh, kill the bird! Tear its wings off! Eat them! Sell them to KFC! I can't be arsed! Uh, come on! I've had work days that are more fun than... Oh, okay, cool. Right. Please be the right... Oh, thank Wait, we can go down again? Alright. I kind of thought that last way was the end of it. I kind of thought, you know, we could just... Please tell me this isn't a dead end. Please tell me this actually leads somewhere. I don't want to think everything I do is in vain. You know, we aren't folly. The night is calling. Tears inside me calling me down. I love Devil May Cry. I can't wait for the day I play Devil May Cry on this channel, but I don't know when that will be. Not because I can't emulate it, it's just I don't know who'd actually watch it, if I'm honest. And I've already beaten all the Devil May Crys, except the mobile game. Yeah, just the mobile game. Uh, what's over here? Pray tell. Nothing! Why is everything just for- oh, oh, fuck off. Please. <laughs> Please! Can't I just, like, level up my fire? Is there a way I can actually, like, Add fire and fire together to get fire rigor. I mean, at least it means I can attack all the enemies at once. Or, or can the fire like spread, jump off the enemies, like gain sentience, become an SCP? SCP FF1 is fucking fire that just wants to burn everything. If used, then I don't know, break. Oh, come on, we literally. Okay, there's only one. That's fine. Give me more of these. This is fine. This is easy. This is an easy lava. Should take a hold on you like you won't feel it, or however that song goes. Oh my god, why? Why? You really don't want me to leave this room. You're really punishing me for going the wrong way, aren't you? 
Right, good, fine. Yeah, yay, yay. Watch me run. Cool. Didn't have that fun, fancy one. All right, fine. It's cool. It's actually... You can tell I'm getting frustrated now. I'm fast-forwarding the game. Probably going to break my fucking audacity. Make it disconnect so you have to listen to the camera's audio. But fuck it. Had that the other day. And actually, the audio didn't sound so bad. I I've heard worse things. Maybe my, maybe my um, audio equipment's getting a level up. <laughs> I, I wish audio equipment worked like that. Because then my audio equipment never fail me. So then I have to actually spend... Oh, come on! Teleport tome. Monster in a box. Cool. Was it a bad one? Oh, just a turtle. Didn't this thing nearly kill me last time? Alright, but I, I, I've leveled up a bit since then. Plus I can, you know, prepare by healing and stuff. This is like a mini boss battle. It, it's, it's nothing. It's easy. Look at that. A thousand. Oh, this is going to be difficult, isn't it? I'm going to make this difficult because I haven't been leveling up my magic. And this guy's really strong and whatever. Alright, well at least Maria's a good magician. Yep, guy felt that, but it's fine. I've come this far, I'm not going to let the game fuck me over now. Yeah. <laughs> but I am going to let the game derp me. I'm going to let it be like, hey, why don't we just get a giant turtle and ruin everything for you? Alright, well at least Maria's the magician of choice so far. She's certainly doing more damage than the boys. Yep. Come on, you guys can do it. I'm... Uh, uh, yep, yeah, fine, just burn. Because I don't know what I'm going to do if I go against another turtle. And I don't have any mana left. Oh, thank God. Okay, cool. Well, at least that wasn't as irritating as last time. Yep, getting all the fire, getting all the magic. Yes, please. Um, all the good stuff. Thank you. Thank you very much. Right, just because I want to make sure I don't have to deal with that again. Let's save the game. Cool. Save has been done. Got more health than usual. That's good. All right, fine. But I'm still kind of in a dead end, stuck and dying. Uh, why can't I increase my speed? Can I just like get a skipping rope and kind of do it like it's like Digimon World 2003? I just want to be able to run away from this shit. Unfortunately, that's not an option. Alright, fine, cool. I'm obviously playing Fantasy Star Online. Uh, the, the older ones. I'm on the third one. I wanted to get through those games for a while, but I'm doing it like every Sunday. Which is what today... No, it's tomorrow. I'm on the 25th of March, not the 26th uh, of 2023. Um, yeah, no, it's an enjoyable game. Certainly, like, a good way of getting into, like, those niche Nintendo Sega kind of things. Oh, man, I really am just saying. I'm, I'm, I'm at the bottom of the battle. Now they're in this game and it's dungeons. It just doesn't have to happen. I don't have to kill these things. Wasn't it like in... Oh, there's a lizard over there. Hi, lizard! Sorry, I just wanted to say it because I get lizards in this room all the time. I don't know if they actually kill the flies or anything, but they're still terrified of me. Wish I had a pet cat and I could see that play with a lizard. But, um, unfortunately... I'm... Well, I was offered a cat the other day, to be honest. I'm not sure if I said this story. I think I did. But just in case, I, um... I got very lonely because I, like... I used to look after seven cats when I was living with Katie. And also got to see other cats, like that one, um... That my um, nephew, my my nephew, uh, looks after and has, um, and yeah, I was missing them. So then I was I was like to some friends, hey, I really want a cat. Can you assist me? Dead end. And now I've got. This. I said I wanted a cat. She actually offered me one, and I was like, oh, that's really nice. But then I said, wait a minute, I'm re I'm renting, and this furniture here isn't mine. Unfortunately, even this chair isn't mine, even though I fucking found it. So I thought, no, oh, please let me run. Come on, they don't even have legs. How could they possibly catch up? No, no, we have to. We have to. I don't have a choice in this matter. There's no way out. There's no way of just enjoying ourselves. You know what? Practice your teleport again. I want to see you use it for real this time. Can you actually can you actually spread the fire a bit? Maybe using the fire will actually work out how I want it to, but I don't think it will somehow. Oh, good. Another miss. One day, the teleport will actually do something. It'll actually have a hit rate. Imagine that. Yeah, when pigs fly. 
And birds learn to fucking, I don't know, swim underwater. Yeah, I, I kind of missed um, the cats, and I really wish I could take that cat in. She even said, like, when I leave the country, which is going to be soon for me, like, uh, th three months off, three, six, three, four months, sorry, depending on how things go. But, um, yeah, she said I could return it to her afterwards, which was very nice of her. I just don't like my landlord. He's so annoying. He's reasonable to an extent. I mean, like, you know, he made things easy enough for me to kind of, like, you know, get set up here and all that. Uh, where's, where's this? Can I go through here? Oh, okay, this is something. Right, I'm surprised. I didn't think it actually could be something I could use. Okay, maybe I kill this guy, and then I get the mithril, and I've got to find my way out. I'll do it now, why not? Heh! <laughs> Rebels. Never thought I'd have to deal with your kind down here. Well, if you think you're getting mithril, you're right. My mithril blade straight through your heart. Bam! Boom! Yeah! Nice, brilliant. Alright, time to die, fucker. Yep, not gonna happen. In fact, you know what? I've got something special for you. And I can't use my fire because, of course. Alright, burn! Burn! I'm not gonna teleport you, I'm just gonna attack. Yep, both three. Brilliant. That actually really hurt. Cool. Burn him alive! He's got metal on, it'll heat him up. Burn, baby, burn! To quote a certain amazing game of the 2000s. Gotta admit, this is strange boss music, though. It makes me feel like I'm in some kind of like Egyptian story. Uh, something to do with a great pharaoh leading his um, people against the forces of darkness and shadow games. Alright, whatever. I'm just going to cure my boy before he dies. He's going to die, isn't he? Uh, just get the girl that's most vulnerable. That's nice of you. I think she's getting better health by the day, though. Yep, burning you alive, but now I've got no magic left. I hope my sword skills work at some point. Oh, dear. Hmm. Alright, it's fine. I can play the patience game. Just, you know, gotta be patient. Oh, I really hope this guy doesn't have that much health. Oh, why does he dodge the arrow? I'm literally at the last bit. In that chest is gonna be some mithril. For sure. For certain. I know this game. It'd be... It'd say, oh, that's it. Fortunately, I don't have a... Well, who are you gonna get? Who are you gonna fucking... Yeah, a nice shot. Glad you missed the bit. To be fair, this isn't as bad as that chaos attack. Like, chaos, like, final battle of Final Fantasy 1. Why? Why? Okay, at least that one did something. But he's still alive, so, you know, maybe maybe that's not such a good thing. Why are all these attacks doing zero? This guy's not even that bad. This is gonna take forever. I'm gonna be here for it. I'm gonna grow old playing this game. Yep, fine. You're doing all the damage. Good for you. Are we sure we don't have any, like, mana restoring stuff? Because I could use that right now. Uh, no, no, no. Got a high sword. No, no. Okay, okay, I can use that, I suppose. I, I don't think that's going to help me much, but nah, I haven't got much choice, do I? Right, cure, save my Minwoo. Before he, you know, ends up injuring himself. Good, yeah, now I've got no mana left. Good. Yeah, cool. I don't know I'm going to make this, am I? just going to miss everything. Fire A? Jesus, that's a lot of fire. Is he dead? No. Now why would he be? Why? That strong attack? Ah, oh, it's useless. Okay. I don't know how much health he has. But maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe one of these attacks will do- oh! God, this is stupid. If I didn't go against those, like, slimes and turtles, he he'd be dead. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. He'd have nothing. Oh! Thank God, I was so sure I was going to lose that. Right, yeah, everyone gets magic. Everyone gets a bit stronger. Yep, yeah, good for you. Oh, you can get some mithril armor. I know he's getting that shit. All right. Ah. Oh. That feels good. That feels brilliant. Okay, and before I forget, you get even more powerful shit. Just double check that you other guys can't get anything good to Okay, so you can get the broadsword, which I don't know why I'd do that to Guy, but... Alright, fine. Well, you know what? That's good enough for me. I may be dying. There may be, like, little to no way out of this dungeon. But I'm gonna figure it out. These guys can't be that bad. I've just got to play slow and steady, use a few potions, etc, etc. But if you think you can get out of this dungeon, you know, get this far, kill the soldier, get the mithril, and then just run for your life, there'll be a link to the game in the description down below. Without further ado, 
Look out for books to come to your channel next time. See ya!